every minute of every day. No turning back now, bro. The Liverpool Women's Hospital is open for business. Who's that? Oh, I'll, I'll go, go. I'll go. Grab a delivery pack. Go, go, go. This is the biggest maternity unit in Europe. I'm trying to figure out which one's in labour. Where everyone is waiting. Don't put it on your... I knew you were going to put it on your head. <laughs> for the final push. I'm changing my mind now, you know, about having this baby. Isn't it funny how you give names to things? I've heard it called the flower, the Mary. I used to call Mary Puppy. Puppy? Yeah. <laughs> Please, you're not no. saying the right thing right now, you knob. Days here are measured in moments that last a lifetime. A little bit more, a little bit more. Come on, keep going. Stop. I can't! Keep Stop pushing me head! Keep it going, keep it going. Where new lives begin. Here she is, babe. <laughs> And others change forever. Oh, she's so beautiful. Oh, she's boss, isn't she? Yeah. I was hoping that I saw you and started crying. <laughs> Sometimes you'll be on a train or a bus. You're often look at other people and think, if only you knew what, what I'd saw today. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, I like her. True Scouser. <laughs>got my eye on some lad who works here. He works for IT. The IT guy. Oh, my God. I've got you a pure crush on him. Oh. Well, if, like me, you know, you're young, free and single, you'd think maybe that working with lots of loved-up couples would get me down. But it, it, quite the opposite, if anything. I'm getting paid to do my research to find myself the perfect man. I said to her ages ago, you need to see this IT man. He's lovely. I think it's because, like, he's got a bit rugged. I think it's just all of a sudden... Made me head turn. He wears the maroon top and he's got like the big beard. He's got he a beard is beautiful. Now. He is lovely looking. So now I've been following him that way. <laughs> I've looked after so many couples over the years. I've kind of built up in my own head what I do want and what I don't want. I even went to IT with Lisa the other day and he went there. I was like, ah. Oh. Kind of like, you know, doing your shopping and throwing out what you definitely don't want. I'll have to start doing that. Password problems. Yeah. <laughs> Once this baby's out the way, mate, I'm getting back out there, letting my hair down. How are you? Go out. Find a younger model of you. You've got some miles on you now, mate. <laughs> I'll have to sit you down and teach you. I'll just speak to a woman. <laughs> what do you mean? I can speak to a woman and not to speak to girls. I'm a single Pringle and ready to mingle. <laughs> <laughs> we would actually split up and then... Um, I've ended up getting pregnant. <laughs> You're proper <laughs> cheesy, you know. Seriously. Oh, I love that line. <laughs> That's why you're still single. <laughs> hey. He was babysitting and I come back drunk and he was a little bit merry. And it just, it just that happened. Happens. I think it was more me than you, like, you know what I mean? <laughs> Right. So you're feeling plenty of movements? Yeah. Brilliant. Your daughter? Hiya. You all right? I'm Hayley, one of the midwives that'll be looking after you both today. OK. Sorry. All right? Been down for some breakfast? Yeah, yeah, I'm hungry. And I'm nil by mouth and he's sitting there. I know, it's a bit mean, a that, isn't it? You could have had it downstairs. I know, <laughs> It's not one of them relationships where we've finished and it's sour. We're just friends, yeah. good friends. Yeah. We're kids together. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds away. like friends with parents. It's, uh, I don't know. it's a nice neat bump. No stretch marks. And I have three kids later as well. I'm quite lucky. That's brilliant. I? So you've had two sections before? Yeah. Yeah. And you're having an elective caesarean yeah. section today. No other procedures at no. all. No. No. Mm. Mm.
Not being together makes us better together and we don't argue because we're not constantly in each other's pockets. Hello? What's going on, brother? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We had, we had triplets. The odds on it, too, scalps on it. It's fair free. She had triplets, lad, for you boys. I swear, lad. She's a lot more mature than me, really, is. A lot more mature, aren't you? Yeah. <coughs> That's really went wrong. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> You're horrible. <laughs> I love people watching off this window sometimes. I know. It's funny, you know, when it's visiting time and, you, and you're watching them all coming in and you see some of them. Yeah, and they're carrying the balloons. Yeah. When you spend a bit of time with the couples, you can see their personalities are so different. It's crazy, isn't it, all the different people that you meet? Mm. You do sometimes think, God, I never would have put you with that particular man. It's hard to explain because everybody's different and, it, and I think it needs to be that way, otherwise we'd all be attracted to the same people, wouldn't we? I used to be really, really selfish. Well, Kaya made me change a lot. It's a little bit hard, <laughs> still. <laughs> but I think the baby's going to change you more. <laughs> yes, true. Hello. Is it Kaya? Yes. Hiya, Kaya. I'm Joe. I'm looking after you today. OK. And you are? Bernardo. Very tired? Yeah. yeah. How are you doing? Fast. It's going slow. My dilatation is going really, really slow. So where are you both originally from? Brazil. Brazil, fantastic. Do you know what you're having? A boy. A boy. <laughs> Lazy boy, you're going to take his time. Yeah. <laughs> what, are you going to call him or are you keeping it a secret till he's here? No, we're going to call him Thor. Thor? Yeah. Oh, fabulous. <laughs> nice, strong name for a nice, yeah. strong boy. Just going to check your pulse if that's OK. Mm -hmm. I don't know why she allowed me to have the boy's name. The only condition that she gave me was, uh, I'm not going to allow you to put the name of your baby, your name. Yeah, was... because he wants to put, like, Bernardo second. <laughs> they said, no, 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 forget about yeah. it. <laughs> it's like something off a film, isn't it, though? Yeah. yeah. First option was, that, oh, can it be Luke? And she said, why? Because then I'm going to tell him, Luke, I'm your father. And he's going to be saying, no! <laughs> like in Star Wars. And he's saying, no, That's no, no, no. That's geek for me. <laughs> Fuel is ready, so we can take you in there. Oh, that looks cool. I'm too at the toilet. Looks really inviting, doesn't it? <laughs> looks really cool. That's the one I want at home, honey. Oh, me too. It would be great to have a bath like that at home, wouldn't it? What makes Bernard happy? Well, it's a pint and a video game, and he will be fine for all day. Yeah, playing video games. <laughs> you getting in with that? You brought your swimming trunks? I brought. Can I? Yeah, some, par oh. some partners do get in. Oh. <laughs> I'm studying to be a game developer, so I'm playing games all the time. And that's research. <laughs> What they call the baby in room two? What? Thor. How boss is that? Thor. I think it's Thor. boss, yeah. That's just a really like strong, name. strong name. I think that's boss. Thor. Oh, I think that's boss. <laughs> Thank you.
Cheers, thank you. Don't want a cup of tea now? No, sir. Are you flirting then, Miss Lumsden? Oh, no, it was I was on night and these two paramedics came in and he was like, you know, make me a cup of tea, where's the biscuits? Dead cheeky. And then he just went, where's the midwife with the uh, silvery hair? I said, oh, she's not in tonight. And he was like, oh, she's fitter. <laughs> like that, he went, is she single? And I went, she is, actually. It's a bit difficult in this type of job to to meet someone. How long have you been together? Four years. Four now. years, and they've got a beautiful daughter Aww. together. <laughs> Just call me Silla Black. When you've you've been in work all week, and you, you know, particularly if you've had a rather busy, busy week, you just want to come home and... Uh, Drink wine. I didn't like wine until I became a midwife. So it was a pool birth something you were quite keen on? Because I noticed you haven't got, like, a birth plan as such, and, you know... Yeah. Yeah, no, I know. Because I know there's a high um, caesarean section rate... In, in Brazil, In yeah. Brazil. Mm. Massive. In Brazil... Women don't start to labor at all. The doctor is scheduled yeah. the date. You go to the hospital, they open your tummy, take the baby, give it to you, and that's it. Is it okay if I have a little listening? Just check on baby again. I decide to have a natural birth because I think we can feel closer to the baby because I feel this connection with our baby. It's something that just feel, feels so right. So that's OK? Well, I think she can handle the labour, yeah. She used to train Kung Fu and she used to be really good at it. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm strong. <laughs> she is, she is. I'm going to put some water in you. I'm going to put some water in your hands. I'm going to put some water in your hands. I'm going in Brazil, the husband's role in labor is be there outside the operation room watching. That's it. Waiting. Waiting. Just wait for yeah. news. I don't want to look for a new position. Can you take a chair for me? I'm going to sit a little bit. Maybe it doesn't matter. Whatever you do, whatever you do, whatever you do, I'm going to sit there. Here, I'll try to do the best that I can. I would definitely be hands-on. I would be definitely be helping her as much as I can. This is your father, baby. <laughs> Typical man, eh? Exactly. So I think it's looking like we might have to. I'm gonna have to shift you off uh, there in a second. I heard. How could you hear? You were snoring. I heard, and it's they are typical men. And I woke up <laughs> when it said typical men. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out which one's in labour. <laughs> I can't wait to be a granny. My mum's that desperate for grandkids. She told me I could go out and have a one-night stand. No <laughs> way. Yeah? <laughs> uh, baby has a belly this morning. Come on, seven, two. OK. Four, five. I feel like you're about to dance for me. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so you'll, you'll give me a black eye. <laughs> <laughs> and nervous now, are you? Why are you getting nervous? I've what what are you nervous over? I don't know. Keep you calm. I'm, I'm calm, mate. Eh? Keep you calm. Keep your mind Good set. Good job I'm awake, isn't it? So I'm keeping you calm. I do wish I could work with Midi. I wish we could be together and be a big happy family and I'll marry her and, you know, fairy tale wedding, whatever, do you know what I mean? But life's not a fairy tale, really, is it? So. 
There'll always be chemistry there, but there's a point where you can over, you know what I mean, overstep it. I think we've got two and a half hours. Our baby boy's gonna be here. Best be my baby boy. <laughs> I was working away. <laughs> yes. You won't be any more drunk at night, definitely. Um, no, we're just gonna stay as friends. I am. No, I'm not, I'm not active. I'm not active. Yeah. Are we good to go? Yeah! Have you got your hat? I'm afraid you have to put off. your silly hat on, yeah. <laughs> I'm afraid so. If we have to look silly. OK. Yeah. Come on, gorgeous. <laughs> oh. Go on. Here you go. Where should you go first? Though? Thanks. I don't know how it's going to be between us now that we're split. She's so excited now to see Yeah, him. to meet him. I'll bet. But I'm not going to love the baby in any less or have no less of a bond as I do with the other two kids. Yeah. OK. OK, Marie. Can you feel yeah. me touching you? Nothing sharp? No. That's good. OK, guys. Thank you. You all right? Yeah. I'm just, just excited. Oh, I couldn't ever see myself being in a full-time relationship with anyone else. There'll be loads of pressure at the top. Yeah. I mean, he's the only girl I've ever loved, and right now, the only girl I can see myself ever loving. I'll leave it here again. This is it now. This is it, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> He's been all comfy in my belly and been like, oh, what's going on here? Yeah. Hello. 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 Welcome to the world, little man. You know, you'll always help her with the kids. We both know what role we play in each other's life. We're like family, but we're not together. Do you know what? I had a mad dream last night that I was in the putting petrol in my car, and the next minute there was this woman. She got this fellow, some fellow shouted, "She's having a baby!" I was have gone, the head's coming. So I, I thought I'll have to go over and help. And I remember delivering this baby, but it had a pumpkin instead of a head. Oh, <laughs> get lost! It was a pumpkin. Head. <laughs> Do you ever yeah, find you have bizarre dreams when you know you've got work the next yeah. day? <laughs> Oh, you're joking. Why can't you just go by your side? I said go there and then we can walk up. What? You're deliberately going to be an arse over this, aren't you? What? Yeah. What are you doing? Stop, don't tell me to shut up. Shut up, Tom. Shut up, Tom. Shut up. I don't know if this is... It says induction street there. There's the one thing she told you. You cocked it up. We first met in school. We've been in the same class from when we were 11. Yeah, I was right in front of you, wasn't I? Yeah. And he just used to wear me up all the time. Hi, you hey, I'm supposed to be here. Hey, what Kate are you and Tom Benson. Yeah, Kate that's fine. Coming into danger. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. I'll just show you around to the room. Okay. Just 
all my friends fancied him and I think, although you don't agree with me, that that's why you didn't like me, because I didn't fancy you. Kate? Yes. I'm Katie. Katie. <laughs> Katie. <laughs> yeah. What's your name? Tom. Tom, how are you? So I'm going to be looking after you tonight, OK? Baby number? Two. Two. So how long have you two been together? Twelve years this year. Was it thirteen years this year? Five years married. Known him for a long time before that, though. Oh, childhood sweetheart. No. <laughs> I mainly remember science class. We used to sit right next to each other and bicker. Yeah. 20 years? Have I known you for 20 years? Known you for 20 years? Well, change it if you keep on saying it. I, mean, I just can't <laughs> believe it. <laughs> we did not like each other. Kate seemed to dislike me for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> I've just found a ball. Thank you. Here we go, this might help. You got a ball at home? Yeah. Used it once. <laughs> I spent longer pumping it up than she's used it. It's <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Kate wants things done yesterday. So I have to deal with that on a daily, hourly basis. <laughs> Come give me some love. I'm a bit more laid back in my approach to things. Slow up, Tom. Look. Slow. Is that slow? I've probably asked for a massage once a week since we've been together, and I reckon I've probably got about five. Thank you. How's this, stop? What are you comments? Oh, come on. Obviously, if we have to be do have our annoyances that annoy each other, but that's how we work. Wouldn't work any other way, I don't think. So I about eight hours worth of gear here, so... See you in eight hours. You are so lucky I'm at age here. Georgina here? We had um, some fella bust and he was looking for his, uh, his partner and she was in the induction suite and he was he, he bust and he was like, hi, yeah, can you? He said, I'm looking for the seduction suite. <laughs> we were all like, we're trying to find that too. <laughs> you do see some men really crumble when their partners are in labour and that's why we're there to give them support. They just don't know what to do with themselves because obviously they can't do anything to make it feel better. Some guy thought he could do the role of a midwife and he tried to push me out the way and he had the gown on the gloves. So I went, no, no, you're OK, you just stand on the other side. I feel sorry for our partners because they've got a lot to live up to. Um, because we see good partners and think, right, you're as good as they get, is mine going to be that? Or you see rubbish ones and you think, oh, no, what if he's that? I've had a couple that have sat down in the chair and fainted and you just kind of, you know, you know that he's safe, he hasn't banged his head, so I just kind of step over them and carry on. Contraction. Mm -hmm. Strong. Mm -hmm. Really strong. Mm -hmm. Yeah, strong. Mm -hmm. Cool. Hello. Hi. I'm just getting everything ready for the examination. Okay. Well, normally in this stressful situation, I normally keep more calm and he is more nervous at the time. Well, I'm the one who's going to be in pain, so I'm allowed to freak out. He's not. The baby is definitely back to back. You can feel the bones on top <coughs> of the heads. Mm -hmm. 
about three centimeters now. <laughs> and now. I really can't believe it. Mm. Well, but she's had it first for hours. By the pressure, I think it's not too good. It's just easier if the baby's in the more preferred position okay. with the head tucked down because the smaller part of the okay. head's coming first, so it's easier for you to deliver. I really not cooperating. <laughs> it's not your fault, honey. It's not your fault. After one whole day feeling pain. <laughs> <coughs> I'm just telling to my husband he could go home. You don't, you're not feeling good? Or just, or just tired? I'm not feeling 100% well. But um, I think I can handle that. Sometimes when you're looking after the, the women, you do have to give a little bit of TLC to the dads. I guess they're quite nervous and it's almost like they want you to tell them what to do. How far away do you live from the Just hospital? Just one block. One <laughs> block? I really don't want to go home. I know, honey, but I really need you better. I need okay. you feeling better. When Bernard is will, he's... Well, I think every man <laughs> come back to be a child again and want someone to just spoil them and then doing everything for them like a mother again <laughs> i think he's a little bit like that as well you okay mm. do you think you'll stay with us or go i, I want to stay but she's she wants uh, me I, to go home to yeah, some I'm tablets saying, and bring, and come i back. really need him better it would be best for me as well my mother always worked when I was young and I spent a lot of time with my brother and sister at home just by herself. I think that makes me learn how to look after people, you know. Do you feel like you need to snooze more or you do you want to wake up? No, I just, I just have a massive headache and I feel like some tractor ran over me, but... Sometimes I'm too worried about him. And then I look after him so well. For him, it's good. <laughs> Definitely for him, it's good. But sometimes I have to remember that we need to look after each other as a couple, of course. Do you want a cup of tea? Yes, please. Yeah. OK. I'll be back in a second. Thank Black, you. please. Black tea, one sugar. Yes, thank you very much. OK. I'll think about it. Okay. What is your name again? Tom. 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 I thought you said Tom, but hmm. I'll ask you another three times. I'll probably forget your name, you know it's the same as her. <laughs> Need a name for our child. Not got a name. Nope. We've been through every bloody name and book you can imagine on the internet and every website. Uh, we are bickering about this. This is on par with doing dishes and lifting toilet seat up. Ted didn't have a name, did he? At first. Five days or something. Yeah. Five days, really? It took us so long to agree on our little boy Ted's name. So once his name was gone. There was never a second one to be able to use for this one. There's, ju there's just, it's just a constant battle trying to think of a name. You got a short list? I had Dylan, and you had, what was the one that you said? Tom keeps bringing up a name that I don't like. George. There's too many now since Prince George. I have to get you thinking, Captain. I don't know if he thinks that if you keep saying it enough, he'll get it, but it's not happening. <sighs> oh my God. Want some tea? Them grey ones are sticking out. <laughs> Can I pull that one? <laughs> Get you to yourself I... next. No, really, I'm serious. Can I just pull just, just that one? The rest look dead sexy. It's just that one. But how thick it is, that's amazing. Look at that, Casey. <laughs> <laughs> 
that. <laughs> I think that's the first time that's ever happened in my career history. <laughs> to the bathroom to cry. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, OK, look, your son's getting me back. Ah! Uh. He knows. Se tiver que usar fora, se tiver que cortar, se tiver que tudo. Mas eu não tô tendo dilatação. Alguma coisa a gente vai ter que fazer. Se você precisar fazer, filho, não tem problema. Eu cuido de você. Eu cuido de vocês dois. I didn't want to get married up until I was 30. <risos> My parents got divorced when I was six. I remember not seeing them, you know, happy together. Just I remember seeing them having arguments all the time. <sighs> that made me want to postpone being married for a while. <sighs> I always used to say that if I'm going to get married, I want to do it once. That's it. And that's why it, it took me so long to get married. Continua, amor. Vai dar tudo certo. Eu tô do seu lado. Vai. When we're sat up for the epidural, okay? We'll just concentrate on your breathing and we'll get through it, all right? And I'll help you through that, okay? We are definitely really sure about each other. I want to make sure that uh, my, my kids are going to have the, their parents together. Okay, I won't leave you, all right? Yeah, you'll be right. fine, yeah? We'll get through it together. Okay. All three of us, okay? I think this is the most dance knockout you since I've ridden. You should help your back. Jordan Lieber, I'll be on the charm offensive probably and trying to keep things calm so I won't rise to Kate's bickering. What are you doing? I'm not helping. How are you on to? About quarter to eight in the morning. We'll have a baby by then. Oh, fingers crossed, it'll be nice. You can't record, Tom. Does it, uh, I haven't seen him a bit. I don't know if we've done it last time, I can't remember. He was in shock when he came off them. They just whisked him off, didn't they? That's what I mean, so I don't, I don't know whether I got chance. the option. If he's been whisked off, if he come out, does he not breathe straight away? Yeah, no, he was just in shock. I might be gassing air time soon. After Ted was born, I just went in and had a shower. I can't really remember much after that. <sighs> there was something that made me go in to look. And Kate was on the floor, collapsed. Preeclampsia developed in the pregnancy, so I got 
really ill near the end. <sighs> Getting hot though. It is, yeah. <sighs> Anything could have happened. I could have lost Kate. Hold on. Where are you? I'm going to be sick. Sick? I'm going to be sick. Yeah. Oh. Part of the problem with this pregnancy is that preeclampsia already has started rearing its head again. I'm not just going in to have a baby. There's, there's something, there's something else now that that's that could ruin all this. Oh, baby, it's getting really hard. No, 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 no. It's getting really hard. <laughs> <sighs> Katerina, I'm one of the doctors on this morning. Now, do you mind if I examine you? Is that okay? Just going to press on you for me a little. How's the dilation? Nothing much has changed, to be honest. <laughs> I think it's pretty much the same as it was before. So you still need to do the So. My feeling is, to be honest, if you've not progressed at all in that time, you know, we could carry on, um, but you'll just become more and more tired. It's really important to me to have a natural labour because I think that the, the, our body was designed to do that. The problem we've had really was, is that your, your body's kind of responded with all or nothing. So when we put the, the drip up, you sort of start contracting very frequently. So baby doesn't like it, so then we have to reduce it. So I think that's, that's also not been helpful. The next sort of thing that I would offer you would be a cesarean section, really. It's unlikely to change. To change, I don't know. My last option to have a scenario. Less, mm -hmm. less, less. Yeah. <sighs> Do you want to wait a couple more hours then, if you're if you're really keen not to? Yeah, I think we can go for cesarea. We can go for cesarea, right? Because sure? just take more two hours. We won't change anything anyway. It's okay. But yeah, if you're ready, that's absolutely fine. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. I will be there for her because she's the only thing I have and she's the best thing that happened in my life.
I love Blake. Come on, calm down, Dad. Baby soon, aren't we? Because of what happened last time with the preeclampsia, I did sort of question us getting pregnant again, didn't I? Breathe, 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 breathe. <laughs> traumatic but hopefully this time it goes a lot more smoother. Well done, well done, fantastic. Breathe. I can't wait to hold him. I can't wait for him to be here. Breathe, 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 breathe. 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 In and out, in and out. Well done, fan. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Breathe. Keep breathing, keep breathing, keep breathing. Hey, Jack, you're doing it, Jack. Right. There we go. Right. There we go. Look, you've got baby. Look down, there's your little boy. Keep breathing. Congratulations to you. Happy birthday, baby boy. Yes. Yeah. Right, bye -bye. <laughs> so everything's good, all healthy, it's normal. Yeah, blood pressure, it's fine. So you know, right, it was fine. Every day, I'm thankful that I'm with Kate and don't want that ever to change. <laughs> as much as we bicker and fight, we are one person. So either of or one of us not being there just isn't an option. That was so quick. Does he look like anybody, name-wise? Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> Sound like you've been on the ale. Yeah. I've been really unlucky in love, but looking after all these women, I have not given up hope. Yeah, but instead of after being on the ale and having a hangover, you're going to have a baby at the end of yours. Yeah. How boss is that? When you get a couple that you look after that are really, really kind of in love... <laughs> I just think, oh, you know, I hope I, I get that someday. Hello, everybody. This is Kaya. Hiya, Everything's okay. going to be all right. Mm -hmm. I want to be the best dad that I can be. I only know there are two kinds of dads, the, the one that are good and the one that are not good. That's it. I'm going to be annoying Thor soon, because I'm going to be like, oh, Thor, I'm going to be making that game. Oh, Thor, I'm making that game. I'm <laughs> playing that game. And he'll be like... <laughs> I think he looks like Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
I think in the future I'll have to find my place inside the house because I think in the end I'm going to have two kids. <laughs> I try not to be the boss one. No, I try to be the part of the team. It's a bulky blanket, that one. Oh, there we go. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Do you want to much. take a seat over here? This way. He's hungry already. <laughs> Look, he's looking for food, yeah. <laughs> I can learn a different thing. I can move to another country. I can do anything, but that never exists an ex-fatherness. I said I'm, I'm a father. So beautiful, yeah, this perfect. Next time... Got a name for her? Um, Electra. What's wrong with Mary or Jane? When people first meet me, they might think I look scary, just because they see all this around my neck. Or Minnie? But that's my signature. They can be called Minnie, they're going to be probably over six foot. And how did you break the news? Well, he's not the dad to the baby, so I was more scared to handle him than my mum. Well, you seem to have took it really well, love. When she first found out, we'd only been together two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> so, it was a bit of a shock. Just how difficult is it to be a young bloke with a new baby? Watch our brand new online series, The Dads, channel4.com slash oneborn. And Oneborn is back at the same time next week. Shocking stuff on Monday night, letting agents, landlords and the people who rent. Britain's benefit tenants continues at nine. Catch up on 4OD. Next up, there'll be tears before bedtime in Gogglebox.